right there flying around I'm not real sure what kind of eagle that is adolescent Let's see if we can get a better walk we're walking into the bear stand let's see if he's been back today June 29th two days left of season today tomorrow that's it I think he has been back. Look at them tracks. I guess he's been back this way. That one for sure is new. Mm -hmm. oh. oh yeah, he crossed the river right there. Check it out. Tink, 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 tink. That's a big bear. Alright, let's go see if we can't connect tonight. There's that eagle up there in that tree. Can't really see him. He's in the wrong spot. He's been back. He uh, took the bucket down again, ripped the barrel off the tree, broke uh, broke some stuff. I'm gonna check my camera, see when he was here. I'll be back with you. I'll show you the drum. He mangled that drum up too. And this is what's left of that 55 gallon drum. Mangled it, still plenty of food in there. Looking at the camera. He was here just a couple hours ago, so he'll be back tonight. So, yeah, anyway. The waiting game starts. Let's see what happens. So I put the barrel back, move that camera closer, and that camera closer. They were too far away. I didn't record the bear, not one photo of the bear coming in here. But clearly a bear was here. It's the only thing that could have ripped that two inch ratchet strap off. Um, looks like he might be coming in or out that way. Anyway, my son's here. This is going to be his bear, hopefully. All right, I'm going to go check the other stand. Well, guys, upper stand. I just took the 300 and the 45 out of the boat. Got the boat tied off up there. And, uh, sorry, spun you around. Didn't mean to. 345 bear stands up in there see you when I get there Grizz tracks fresh so I'm hunting the upper stand tonight I just hunting the lower I don't even have to go in there always check out the mud bars you know especially if you're in an area That'll tell me there's been a bear. I'm gonna go get my in reach and I'm gonna settle in for the night. And here at the other bait, see where he tore it up. And that drum was next to that drum. That drum's ripped off the tree. Anyway, bugs are bad. That's uh, I'm gonna pull a SIM card 
I'm gonna go chill in my stand. I thought maybe I had one coming in. I thought I heard it snap in its jaws, but that was an hour and a half ago. Anyway, I'll check back in with you later. So I just come out to the boat to uh, give Isaac some time in the ground blind. No sooner did I get out to the boat and uh, start setting stuff up so I could take a nap because I've been up for the last 23 hours and I hear a gunshot. What would you do Isaac? I hit the bear. Uh, if it's the same grizz we've been seeing, this is the last day of grizz season we got. 22 and three quarter hours left um, but it's about eight and a half foot grizz by the camera anyway we pulled out he said he shot at center of the chest 300 wind mag about 70 yards so we backed out to the boat we're gonna see if we hear a death moan and uh, if we don't hear a death moan in the next hour and uh we're gonna head to uh head to the house and we'll come back in the morning after we get some quality rest yeah, it's 1 30 a.m yeah by the way 1 30 a.m in alaska and uh we'll put the track on him i don't want to chase a wounded bear through the willow not right now we'll give him a couple hours see you in a couple hours